any bearings on the signal. The line 157-330 oh, an hour later that the plane was flying on the northwest to southeast navigational line that bisected Howland Island. So I'm sitting here watching a video on uh, Amelia Earnhardt. You know, what happened to her? And uh, my camera comes on. I forgot all about it. And I'm not even kidding. I probably pushed the button probably an hour ago. But uh, well, I got y'all here. Yeah, I'm smoking a drink. But uh, oh yeah, well, while I got you here, this weird thing happened earlier. I don't, I don't want to talk about the button pushing problem with this GoPro. It's the Hero Session 4 or Session 4, whatever. You press the damn button and then sometimes it don't come on. And you don't, it's like, what are you doing? And it, like one time I pushed it earlier and it was like, oh, busy. It, it popped up on the little thing and said busy. I'm like, you're a camera. What are you busy for? What are you doing? But anyway, how much, how much battery is on here? Oh, not much battery. Anyway, this is why you shouldn't have a gun. Oh, it was, oh, what time, what time is it now? Uh, oh, let me put my video down. It's 11.44 now. It was about 9 o'clock or something. These two dudes showed up at the house ran out of gas supposedly and uh the one there was just like one fat dude and he was like just looking around like like crazy he was just like i mean crazy looking i'm gonna plug my oh shit i can't plug it in but anyways these two dudes were like when i opened the door they were like kind of aggressive a little bit. They're like, hey, you got any gas? You know, being like really weird. And then I had my gun. I keep my gun on me. And normally I take it off when I come home. I take it off and I put it away in its in, 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 in its safe place. But I didn't tonight when I got home. And I'm glad I didn't. But, uh, these are from, uh, cases of bullets, <laughs> stickers. But, man, they were weird. And I, I, I was eating a hot dog when I answered the door. And, uh, I was like, man, who the hell are these guys? Let them use my phone to call somebody and stuff, and I don't even think they called anybody. Because when I got my phone, it didn't look like they called anybody. But I did a test, I called the wife's phone, and the same icons were there. So I don't know if they called anybody or not. It's like they called anybody or they didn't answer or maybe left a message or something. I don't know. But this is why you have a gun. You got two weird ass dudes. One of them. They both look like fucking crackheads. Like, I'm not even playing. They look like fucking, like, were cracked out. The one guy was like. And I'm not even, I'm not even exaggerating. That's what he was doing. 
motherfucker looked like Hillary Clinton having a goddamn fucking seizure. Looking around, fucking all kinds of crazy. And I made sure they saw my gun. You know, I was like... And about a minute and a half into the conversation, I took the strap off of it. I was like, y'all, you know, you don't come over here starting shit or something or whatever the fuck it is y'all trying to do. I'm about to run out of battery. So, keep your fucking pistol on you or can get to it real quick because you know some weird ass people can show up at your house and you don't know what their what their mentality is they could need some gas or they want some goddamn human stew you don't know you don't know keep the pistol handy